Welcome back, my beautiful subscribers. I want you to listen to this video because according to what was said, UAG are working tirelessly to make sure disbursement take place. So guys, pay attention to this info and let's continue this conversation. Make sure you subscribe to the update and share this video so that people can also take advantage of it. Appreciate you guys for stopping by and bye for now. Uh, it's a letter written to the uh, subscribers of UAAG. This is coming from OSIM. OSIM, we all know that is an inside man uh, that has a lot to say about uh, the disbursement of UAAG grant. It's been with the country director a couple times and uh, also as an insider towards uh, all what we're expecting. So it has this to say uh to the subscribers of uaag and i'm going to read that uh, for us so that we can also get abreasted with what is ongoing at the moment all right paying attention to this dear fellow uaag subscribers i wasn't assigned to write this piece of encouragement i was simply inspired to do so after reading many discouraging posts about our expectations I understand that the journey toward the disbursement of the UAAG grant has been challenging and many are beginning to feel disheartened. It's easy to suspect foul play when things don't move as quickly as we hope. But let me remind you that we are dealing with a significant financial project that naturally involves numerous bureaucratic processes. For any disbursement of such magnitude, there are strict regulations and governmental procedures that must be adhered to. No large sums of money can be injected into the economy without the express approval of the relevant authorities. These approvals take time as the presence and oversight of key powers are required to ensure everything is done according to the law be assured much is happening behind the scenes that cannot be disclosed publicly and i think that should be the real deal here that a lot is happening behind the scene that we might not be privy to at this moment and uaag is not obligated to bring everything being done behind bars or behind the skin behind the screen or the scene towards uh, the view of every individual the fact is that there is a process and it's ongoing there are work being done and they are ongoing all right so uh, uaag is working uh, uh let me take that uh, paragraph again these approvals take time as the presence and oversight of key powers are required to ensure everything is done according to the law be assured much is happening behind the scenes that cannot be disclosed publicly uaag is working tirelessly to navigate this regulatory bottlenecks the recent stirrings and attacks we've seen from the opposing side can be seen as confirmation that progress is being made the enemy only stares when something great is about to happen so let us remain patient and calm the disbursement is sure and will take us all by surprise when it finally comes keep the faith i believe we are almost there because i can see light at the end of the tunnel sincerely purple heart all right uh, that is from uh osim uh for us to get a feel of what actually is going on the there is work going on behind the scene so don't let your heart be troubled just like we've told us before in 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 cases like this there are people when 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 issues has to deal with money definitely you know people becomes edgy and itchy uh there are those who have not invested a cobble or a penny into this grant 
and uh, possibly they just uh, sending their names and uh, to their cluster heads and that is all they had to do but because there's a promise that was given to them they become so edgy and agitative they can call you names they can insult you they can you know whip out uh, a lot of things concerning you but just because there's a promise Yes, I'm not saying now, get me clear. I'm not saying that what has been promised to you should not be given to you. But there are times that we don't know what goes on behind the scene. We don't know what happens. But we just have a culture that hates delay. I, I tell you, Nigeria belongs to a culture that hates delay. And if everything does not happen as at the time they expect it, then it becomes a bad luck and anyone that comes across your path to even encourage or to tell you about the process is also a victim you know it's also a victim we've had a lot of uh, influencers that have come out in the time past uh, or encouragers also that came out uh, that have come out to say one or two things just uh, to encourage uh, the alien subscribers but because the money didn't come despite they had a good heart to encourage them and the money as that now has not dropped they are being labeled they are the black sheep they are being called names you know and you that is listening to this voice knows now you might be one of those who had labeled some people who had a clean heart just to give you information in time but you had called them names you had labeled them but you never knew what was going on behind the scene and they had to shut their mouth because they felt they could help but what people term as help is when you don't give the fund or the money is not out then keep your help to yourself anyway whatever it is you can take your take but whatever happens is the fact remains that uh uaag is preparing for the best for you so remain calm and exercise patience because the disbursement of UAAG grant is sure. And as was said to us in this uh, write-up that it's going to take you and I by surprise. When it finally comes, you're going to forget the time of pain, the time of waiting. It will be historical. And I want you to keep the faith. Believe that we are almost right at the door where the blessing is going to fall. Take courage just be sure that it's going to happen and this is where we're drawing the curtain for today's commentary we will come back to you again dear subscribers fellow subscribers when we receive we'll give you updated content thank you and have a very blessed